Hey there guys, I'm Nimput K and welcome to 2020. Let me take you on a little tour of what is and what will not be my studio. So first things first, we gotta get rid of all of it. All of it is gonna go. Starting with the chair. So now that we got that out of the way, it is time to actually clear everything that is behind us back to a bare minimum of having only the wall. Now there is one tiny exception I might let in, and that would be the upper shelf where the entire Funko pops up. Not entirely sold on that, because I kind of don't want to, you know, do that. I, I kind of don't really want to fill up the holes again. So the reason for getting everything back to a bare minimum of only having a white wall in the background and nothing really clothering it is basically, I want to start from scratch. Second, we're gonna start a new series that is going to show you what it actually takes to become a streamer, a YouTuber, a content creator, or whatever else we might think of. And for that, we need, basically, our little studio space. And this is gonna be it. This is gonna be our little filming room, our little filming space. Third, or fourth, I don't even remember how many options I already dictated. The thing is, I ended up doing this and I quite don't like it. I don't like it for the simple fact that I cannot stream in the conditions I was hoping to. So that said, I need to take all that and move it out of frame right now because you can't see where it's going to be. Uh, so yeah, I'm hoping to get the green screen running again, get good lighting over there and make it so that only the green screen is in focus as a background and not the entire room. Welcome to the other part of the room. Also, this is kind of annoying because I can actually hit it. That said, if my desk is over here, I will never have to deal with that thing ever again. Plus, it's a good light source that's going to come from up front. Oh, yeah, uh, so this is the other part of the frame that you didn't see to our right side from our previous frame. Over there is the like wall. So yeah, this entire thing over here is going to be our little command center. So that's what's gonna come right here. Wife can be over there doing her silly work, whatever. <laughs> and yeah, I'm gonna have all the necessities right over here. Everything I need to play video games over here and nothing really obstructing a giant ass green screen behind me because let's face it right now where you're sitting when i had the desktop over there i would have to put my green screen in the middle of the room and it still wasn't okay lighting positioning also the background if, if someone walked behind it it would forget about it okay Let's take you back and let's start this thing. Well, I guess first we gotta get the, this PC out of here, so that's gonna be a pain in the ass because of all the cabling that's back there. And the easiest way is to just start one thing at a time, take everything apart, put it aside, and then when everything's finished, just Reassemble it.
Now unfortunately, this other side is a whole mess. So now we gotta get this thing cleaned up so I can actually have a place to put my new desk. That actually ran a little bit. So I think I'm gonna have to move uh, my wife's desk in order to get this bad boy up on this wall and yeah I'll figure out an excuse later <laughs> Ooh, done and dusted. Now to set up a desk situation over here. And voila, the desk is set. Now all I gotta do is put everything back. And the reason why I ended up putting that over there, first, you can't see anything that's under the table basically. So it's a nice wall, so to say. Second, it's an extension of my table, allowing me to have more free room on, you know, the, the table itself. And third, the monitors will be right back there. I know it's a little bit risky, but they won't be in my face. Considering I have to sit pretty snug to the desk, so I can't really go back. I mean, I could a little bit, but considering I, I'm planning on having the green screen here, I'm probably not gonna be as flexible to always go back. And I tend to lean in, as most gamers do. So, having eye problems already sucks. So, yeah, having the monitors a little bit more in the back, I would say that's a, that's a win for me. Let's just hope uh, everything turns out okay. It's a new day! Oh, man, I feel tired. Whew. Okay, welcome guys, welcome back. You know, it's funny how a lot of YouTubers or creators, when they have a project that is supposed to be like one video and they end up taking one or a few more days more than, you know, just the one day to finish, they try <laughs> to wear the same thing and act as if it's one continuous build or project or something like that even though they're taking multiple days because let's face it inside a confined space studio where you create time is kind of irrelevant because no one really knows how much time is going on because you edit everything and whatnot so yeah um nope 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 i'm not gonna I'm not gonna be one of those guys, I'm not gonna do that. I might, at some point, in, in certain projects, if it really helps, but today, nope. Really tired, woke up on the wrong side of the bed, you might say, but that's beside, beside the point. So yeah, here it is, here's my new office base. It's still, it's still gonna be a work in progress a little bit, but mainly we are, we're going to have this place for shooting uh, nicer things. You know, we have a little bit more, more room, more space to do certain things, certain projects. And then we have this to the side where uh, I can edit, I can stream, I can play, I can not be in the way. It's not a distraction when we're doing anything else over here. So. Hope you guys enjoyed what you saw up until now. 
we're definitely gonna do a lot more in the future. We're also going to start, I don't know if I mentioned that yesterday, but we're going to start uh, a couple of new projects, uh, one of them being a new series on how to get started with Twitch and how to get started with YouTube and a lot more stuff that revolves around these creative processes. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Hoping you guys enjoyed the beginning of 2020. I know it's a little bit late for me, but I don't want to get into that. Personal issues, whatever. We're here now, we've started, and I'll see you guys next time.